What's up guys, Darkstokami here, doing a playthrough of The Wolf Among Us, Episode 1, doing this kind of as a homage to uh, The Walking Dead Season 2 being released yesterday, well Episode 1 of it, anyway. So, I haven't really seen much of this, I've seen about the first 10 to 15 minutes of it. So, if you are coming to this without any knowledge of it, really whatsoever then you're just about as clueless about it as I am so we're both in the same boat there so no need to feel too bad all right so I'm not gonna I'm gonna try not to talk during cutscenes and I'll just stop my babbling and get on with it so we got episode one Let's get it underway. So yeah, this game's by Telltale and it's practically the same sort of gist as The Walking Dead. But anyway, you guys can read this and I'll be quiet until we're prompted to do something. So, read away. Again, if you missed it, a record for the date. Hottest ever in June. Uh, 103 now. That humidity looks low, but remember, the hotter the air is, the more moisture it can hold. So 103 with 31% humidity is a lot more humid than, say, 73 with 31% humidity. And it is muggy out there. So excited for this. Oh. Mr. Toad? Shit! Big B! Listen, mate, I, I know I don't look human. It's a problem, I get it. I just stepped out the apartment for just a second to see what kind of damage this drunk shit is doing. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Cross my mm. arm. No need to kick up a fuss. I'm looking at a three-foot toad <laughs> in a sweater. That's a problem. Indeed. If you can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. You can't send me up to live with those animals. You know what I mean. Go see a witch. Get a glamour. Come on. They're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spout goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? I understand that, but mm, I'm afraid. I don't make the rules. Sorry. I can't give you a free pass on this, Toad. My hands are tied. Right, right. There's too much at stake. Sorry, Mac. Whatever it costs, it's worth it. You don't want me catching you out of glamour again. Fucking hell! Right. See? This is what I told you about, Sheriff. <laughs> You're just gonna stand there, do something, Big B, before he completely tears up the place. What the bloody hell am I dealing with? So, what 
What am I walking into exactly? A woodsman's on another bender. He's been going on like that for hours. Turn this place to dust if you let him. He's in a fucking rage. Oh. This is the last straw, Big B. He has to go. Yep, fair enough. So what set him off? Who knows why it was this time? Man's got a hair trigger. I avoid him as much as possible. When did he start drinking? Not sure he ever stopped. <laughs> oh boy. Fuck you! I didn't know anyone else was up there. Huh. There you go. Furry prick got shite. Tell me how to spend my money. Mm. Dad, the lights are shaking again. What did I say? You want a big bad wolf to take you away? No. Then get that fuck back inside! Jeez, kitties are getting unslaughtered with the F-bombs. Woo! Look out. Alright, so we're Big B, and we gotta go solve some crimes. See what this drunken lunatic's doing. Doesn't sound good. Not good at all. All right. So we got control now. Doesn't sound too good. What do we got here? Matchbook. All right, let's pick it up. Hmm. This could come in handy. What's this? Uh. Okay. All right. Let's put the phone back on the hook. Oh, that's like that. Uh, well, we could just knock politely, but he sounds like he's been a dick, so fuck your door, mate. God damn you! No way! Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, hey! You've got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid? <laughs> <laughs> Hey. I'll fucking kill what the you. fuck's going on? What'd you hear that? Alright, why'd you hear that? You prick. What are you gonna fucking do, huh? Oh. Get the fuck out of the way before you get the answer. One chance. Woody, this is your last warning. Woody. If you keep on like this, I won't have any choice but to put you down. Like the dog you are. You've got a shit fucking memory, Wolf. That's not how it went last time. This isn't last time. Biatch. Oh, got some quick time events. Ow. Uh, oh, oh, right trigger. You prick. Into the sofa. Had enough. Ah. Fuck you. Please, it's a fucking challenge. Oh, yeah. Ow. Ah, shit. That, that. Left trigger. Bitch. Ah, uh, there. Back off, asshole. Uh oh. Oh, down we go. Fuck your knee. In the air. Oh, head, whatever. Now let's take this bitch to school. Into the shelf. Ah, beer bottle! On the back of the head! Oh, fuck yourself! Oh, fuck you! Down! Bench! Into the bed! Go have a nap! Ah, punky be proud! Another right! No- Oop, no! Oh! Playing hard to get ow. Uh oh. Oh boy. Jesus Christ. The fuck do you think you're doing? Give me that. Prick. Oh. <laughs> Youch. Oh boy. You should probably get out of here. Look, 
I'm not leaving until I get what's mine. You're not getting shit, bitch. <laughs> I'll fucking put you in the ground. Say that word one more time. Come on. What? Bitch? <laughs> Did I say? Fuck, Todd. Oh, fucking shit. You bogged my jaw, you bastard. <laughs> oh, I'm liking Big B already. Shit. What the hell is going on? What happened? A little misunderstanding that turned into a real shit show. Don't worry. You saw the best bits. There's more where that came from, girly. Knock it off. Look, this is just the start of a shitty night for me. I just need the money he owes All me right. and I can go. Are you okay? You all right. I'm hunky dory. Thanks for asking. <laughs> What's your name? What's your name? Whatever you'd like it to be, handsome. Uh, Don't make this more difficult than it has to be. Sorry, Sheriff. Wouldn't want to add any difficulty to your night. Why was he hitting you? He asked me if I recognized him, knew who he was. I said I didn't. He started beating on me. Then you showed up, started beating on him. That about cover it, hon? I'm the woodsman, you whore. Whoa. I saved Little Red Riding Hood from this monster. I cut this fucker open and filled his belly full of <laughs> stones. And threw him in the fucking river. That's who the fuck I am, you stupid bitch. Uh, would you excuse me for a moment? <laughs> By all means. All right, motherfucker. Ooh. Hope that car's okay. Oh yeah, and Big B too. Don't wanna know what happened to the woodsman though. I don't know. We get his just desserts, I suppose. That's what happened to the car. Ah, shit. Oh, Mr. Toad. Hey, Toad. <laughs> My car. Oh, it was yeah. his. Give me a second. Oh. oh, no, by all means. Take your time. Make yourself comfortable. Sorry, mate. Uh, sorry about the car. We ended up going out the window. Couldn't be avoided. I'll be mad at you. I called you, and you come to help. I can't be mad. But even when you help, things end up more fucked than they started. Oh. Well, at least you're not fucking dead. Oh. Oh dear. Hey, that's my throat. Can you please stop that? Fucker. Not very nice. Let me fucking grip your I ah! My finger, bitch. I ain't no dog. Sorry, you guys can hear the controller, but this bitch. Oh boy. Oh. <gasps> Thanks. Oh boy. <laughs> You're still going. Persistent little bugger, aren't you? Uh. Thanks. Don't mention it. I'm just getting what he owes me. Fair enough. Are you alright back there? I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Not if I can avoid it. Great. <gasps> the guy's got an axe in his brain. He's not feeling it. <laughs> it's more from me. He'll be fine. Oh, oh, God. Don't give up. Let me help you. 
Ah, fuck it. He's having a bad day. That makes two of us. I guess it's a good thing fables are hard to kill. Suppose it is. Oh, there's a lost cat. Oh. Yeah, might need that axe. Oh. oh shit, she's getting away. Come on, Bigby. Don't let her go, man. Smoking's bad for your health. Oh. I guess we do it too. Uh, yeah, give her the matchbook. Here. Yeah. You know those Thanks. would come in handy. Lips are sealed. Sorry. How about we stick a tongue in them? Would that loosen your lips? Maybe. Hey, you like my ribbon? It's pretty. Yeah. Beautiful. Thank you. Um. Was that a bad choice? Feel like we've met before. We probably have. We all sort of knew each other at one point or another. But things change, I guess. I guess. Hmm. Uh, where'd he go? Shit. <laughs> Stop. We don't have to make any more of a thing out of it than it already is. He hit you. He needs to pay for that. He's, He's got nothing to give, Sheriff. I checked. Besides, I just swung an axe into the guy's head. I'd say we're even. Hmm. Maybe I should be arresting you. <laughs> I'm not going to be doing this for much longer. So, now's your chance. Uh... Aww. How much was the OJ? A hundred. I'm guessing it'd be bad for you to show up empty handed. I'll be fine. Come on. I gotta. Yeah, I can't just leave her like this. Let's see, I've got. Uh, it's 20. 50, 58. That's all I got. Help, right? Take it. It's okay. I'll be fine. You've done enough, really. Just take the money, okay? Yeah, come on. You got me out of a bad mm. situation back there. Thanks. I'm still gonna need a statement. <laughs> I have to go drop off what I have. Meet me back at my office then. It's a little late for an office visit, Sheriff. I'll swing by your apartment. How do you know where I You live in the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Everyone knows that. Everyone? Good to know. <laughs> you look like shit. And I don't use that term lightly. Some of these look pretty bad. Wow. Tell me what you really think. Uh. Whoop. Hey. I need to tell you something. Yeah. What is it? Root, 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 You're root. not as bad as everyone says you are. Eh, better than nothing. I'll see you around, Walt. No. Man, I'm already in love with this game. It's crazy. Not as much as The Walking Dead, but still.
Hmm. It's late. Have we got. Oh! <laughs> Sorry, you guys didn't realize we had control yet. Uh, okay. So what do we got here? We got. We got a note. Oh, a plaque, sorry. Let's have a look at it first. Come on, Big B, have a look. Luxury apartment. Wish they wouldn't advertise that. How come? No. Uh, yeah. Can't really do anything else here. Alright. Enter. Another plaque. What's that say? Stay off the grass. Sometimes be a disciplinarian. Hmm. Well, I wouldn't know since we don't get snow here in Oz. You Americans are very lucky. Christmas is usually in summer here, so all that stereotypical Christmas stuff doesn't usually happen with us, with like snowmen and all that jazz. But now, yeah, whatever. Who that? There's no walking on the grass, no white's orders. She made a sign in every <laughs> she I'll be sure to send her an apology. Beauty. <gasps> oh Hello, Big B. I wasn't expecting anyone. I know this looks a little odd, but there's an explanation. Why'd you hide when I walked up? Well, I didn't know who it was. You can't be too careful these days. No, can't. Yeah, fair point. Damn it, I'm late. For what? Mm -hmm. Please, Big B. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. He worries too much as it is, and it would just make my life a lot easier. Just please. Alright. Sure. You promise? Yes, I promise. Fucking promise. Thank you, Big B. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, but I have to go. Thank you for trusting me. Really, I... I appreciate it, Big B. You is very welcome. Come on, don't look so glum, chum. All right. Snooze. Ah, uh, mailbox. Let's have a look. Been a while since I got any mail. Two oh four. Seventh day in a row. Ah, damn. No one loves us. Oh, let's have a look. What do we got here? The knight armor, suit of armor. Why can't you need to dust this guy? <laughs> can we touch it? No, you're not supposed to, but can we touch it? <laughs> yep, <laughs> bunch of dust. Alright. Oh, uh, yeah. What's he doing? <laughs> I've got a feeling this won't do much, but let's try talking to the bozo. You wink. Grimble. Hmm. Probably for the best. Righto. All right. Well, let's see what we got over here. Uh, what's on the floor? Bigby's name tag. What's my name tag doing down there? Damn thing fell off again. You gonna get it? 
Okay, apparently we're just leaving it there. Uh, then directory. Where is we? Oh, I see. Ah, it fell off that. Okay. I was right. We are two o four. How much longer is this gonna go on? Hmm. So it's interesting to note that on this building directory, everyone's tags and stuff are all the same, except Bigby's got it on like a piece of paper stuck up to the wall. And these mail boxes are all essentially the same colour of brown, whereas Big B's is a lot lighter and stands out. So just an interesting little detail that Telltale is so good at delivering. Obviously it's nothing, you know, um groundbreaking, but it's it's a nice little touch. So what are we gonna do? Look at this again. I think the sheriff would get a permanent listing. <laughs> okay, so we must be uh, temporary guests here or something. Uh, yep, elevator button, push. <sighs> here we go. All right, in we go. Uh, is that Bigby. a beast? Hey, wait up. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Thought so. Uh. So, have you? No, I haven't. Nope, haven't seen her. I promise. Oh. Okay. Sorry to bother you. Mm, I feel Damn bad. It. Something's going on. I don't know whether I should have done that or not. Hmm. What a night indeed. Alright, we got control again. What's this? Fridge and the freezer. And a net pinned to the wall. Which we can't access. Um, let's open the freezer. Ice cubes. Damn it. <laughs> None in there. You came well prepared, Bigby. What's in the fridge? God, alright. Anything back? Nah. Alright, let's see what the rest of the house has got. What have we got here? Some paper on the floor. Apparently, whoa. It's a quarter past twelve or three in the morning. Yeah, I know. Bluebeard folder, okay. Bluebeard's file. Hmm. I wonder who Bluebeard is. Got some Chinese food. Let's take a look. Don't even remember ordering that. <laughs> Probably a bad sign. Yeah. What have you been doing, Bigby? Man. At least this still works. Alright, let's turn it on. Should help. Yep. 
it's actually it's weird because it's pretty hot day here where I am as well uh what the fuck Colin That didn't really work, Bigby. Just push Tubby off. Oh, hey, Bigby. <laughs> I'm in your chair, huh? Yeah. <sighs> Come on, I'm tired. I'm tired, Colin. It's been a long day. He's got a pig, but I get. He definitely making an interesting roommate. I can say that. I'll got a him. smoke? You're a fucking pig. You don't need a smoke. It's bad enough humans do. Oh my god. Thanks. A couple thousand more of these, we'll be even on that house you owe me. This has got to stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. Oh, okay. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Bigby. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. <sighs> Come on. That's a little dramatic. that for me? Nope. <laughs> the house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Uh. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but uh, it would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. It also would have shown everyone how different you are. I see. He's one of the three little pigs. Yeah, come on. I'm tired. Sorry, man. If that was all you were saying, I'd be able to get some rest. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. Whoa. Everyone hates me. Why? So, everyone hates me. Nah, I'm just giving you shit. Okay. I'm doing my best here. Clearly that is not true. What with the selfishness with the bourbon. <laughs> You fucking pig. Uh, no, um, hates the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You ate a lot of people back in your day. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories either. Hmm. Look, I'm not saying it's fair, but it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, look at your hands. Who'd you get in a fight with? A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. I was doing my job, believe it or not. Your job is to beat the shit out of fables. <laughs> Sometimes I take them to the farm. Ooh. Fuck you. Whoa. You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. Gotta be the By boss. By being big and being bad. Don't say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. You're a pig. Smoking a fucking cigarette. That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. Not everyone. Nope. Name one. Oh, fuck. What was the name? Yep. Yeah. I'm gonna go with beauty. Beauty. Oh yeah? Yeah. I told her I'd lie for her. Right. Yeah. That's real nice of you. Oh fuck. I didn't think that through. <laughs> Life is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a long fucking time. In retrospect, not really. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Ooh. Well, maybe if my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. Oh my god, he's 
He's persistent. Right, just give said. me a drink, please. Colin, enough already. I haven't slept in two days. I went out a second story window, and I want to get in two seconds of shut eye before I. Look, if I give you this, will you let me sleep? Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. Probably. All right. He's our mate. Thanks, Bigby. Not that you need it. Christ. Fucking pig! Jeez. Going down for a nana nap. 